Uh, okay, so now it's time for our student guest. Uh, he starred in a Broadway musical called 13 when he was just Woo! a kid. Yeah! Uh, he's in the recently released Colin Jost film, Staten Island Summer. Woo! Uh, and he's on CBS's The Good Wife, which has won a Golden Globe and five Emmys. So we're hoping to steal one from him over the course of the interview. Uh, please give a round of applause for Graham Phillips. My parents, largely, I guess. <laughs> uh, my parents were the first people in their, you know, lineage to go to college, and I think that they sort of felt like, you know, I shouldn't, I shouldn't immediately go back on what they had started. Um, <laughs> my sister went to Princeton, and uh, she was a huge influence in my decision. And uh, honestly, I was homeschooled for three years of high school, and uh, I just, I kind of wanted to, I don't know, do it more conventional social thing. <laughs> <laughs> so how do you balance being on The Good Wife currently and going to college? How does that work? Well, now it's pretty easy because my character's off in college, so I'm not really doing too much on The Good Wife anymore. So I'm back for like the Thanksgiving episode and the Christmas episode, you know, I like poke my head in. Um, but uh, I guess it would, I was in a unique situation um, in that the executive producers were really accommodating uh, the first few years here. Um, I told them that I didn't have classes on Fridays, and they made it so that I basically filmed exclusively on Friday, so it was really easy. Wow, and assuming you had to audition for the good wife, right? You've had to audition for all of your roles. Uh, have you ever had like a really embarrassing audition experience, or one that didn't go the way that you planned? Y yeah, I'd say most don't go the way that you planned. <laughs> I'm so but. sorry. <laughs> There was this one film, Anne Hathaway was, was in it, and it, ha it had to do with this kid that went into a coma, and then he wakes up, and he's like, he's a, he's a musician, and I had, um, <laughs> and I, I really didn't expect to, uh, I, I didn't prepare as well as I should have for this particular audition, and I went in, and it was in New York, and I, I went in, and, and, and Hathaway is in the audition um, to read with me. Anne Hathaway, and I was, I thought it was just like a preliminary audition with just the casting associate, but the director was there, the producer was there, and Anne Hathaway, and she's there to read the scene with me, and I didn't even have the damn thing memorized and completely, and she's there, and it's a scene where I wake up from a coma. <laughs> and there's a, there's a sofa just like this one, and then she's, she's like, do you want to do it like on the sofa, like as if you're waking up from the hospital bed? And I'm like, uh, yeah, sure. And I'm, I'm just like, I, I'm so jarred just because I didn't expect to see any of these people. And so I'm like, I'm, I'm back like this. And she's like, you can totally rec recline. I'm like, okay. Um, <laughs> am I, am I you're in. You're in. <laughs> I start the scene, and the scene starts when the kid wakes up from this coma. <laughs> and so I open my eyes, and Anne Hathaway is sitting like this, and she's like, she's like just waiting, I guess, you know, for me to wake up. And, she just me and, she, and then she just starts bawling. <laughs> and I have this script, and I don't even know the lines. <laughs> and I'm looking at her, and she's just bawling. <laughs> Watching it halfway in a film, just as I was at any point in my life, right then and there. It was, it was, it was terrible. <laughs> 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 <laughs>